1928, a four-and-a-half-litre Bentley driven by Wolf Bernardo and Bernard Rubin took the chequered flag at Le Mans. It was one of five historic victories at the famous circuit that were to make Bentley a legend. <laughs> completely new Bentley has evolved. New in every respect. Body design, matrix grille, unique alloy wheels. The purposeful stance of a thoroughbred Bentley. Handcrafted, the interior reflects its lineage. The double-stitched Connolly hide. The curved form of the veneer fascia with its parchment instruments. The sport's four-spoke steering wheel. The new five-speed automatic transmission is linked to the adaptive suspension system, setting new standards for Bentley road holding and ride. Peak torque is delivered from only 2,500 revolutions per minute due to the low inertia turbochargers, which are close coupled to the exhaust manifold to maximize the exhaust energy. The result is instantaneous throttle response, 50 to 70 in only 3.4 seconds, making overtaking effortless. Computer technology monitors and adjusts the suspension characteristics each hundredth of a second, ensuring optimum balance and poise to suit road conditions. The new twin-turbocharged V8 produces 350 brake horsepower, 0-60 in just 6.2 seconds, and top speed limited to 150 miles per hour but with enough stopping power to bring it to rest from 60 miles per hour in just three seconds. The engine's power characteristics demand an equally agile transmission and chassis. The body shell is 65% stiffer than its predecessor, and the weight distribution is perfectly balanced between front and rear. Whatever transmission mode is selected, the thrill of driving is maintained. Sport is the most responsive and involving. So how appropriate to name it after a corner. But not just any corner. A corner called Arnage. One of the hardest tests of the Le Mans circuit. A corner, the first four and a half litre Bentley, took many times on its way to victory all those years ago. Bentley Arnage.